Hey guys, it's John here again. Right, this is going to be um, a video review of a Judas Priest album, and today it's going to be Defenders of the Faith. Um, right, this album originally came out in 1984, and uh, this is um, oh. This is the 30th anniversary one there, look. And would you believe it? I've had this for a while now, and I still haven't opened it. It's still sealed. Mm. Uh, there's there's a bunch, a hell of a lot of good stuff on there. It's amazing. Um, so, if you're going out to buy it, get the deluxe one. 30th anniversary. Uh, this one here is from the remasters of uh, 2001 I think it was uh, yes it is and it comes out of this you can put it get this box if you can find the box uh, I bought this one it all came out uh, so this album um, starts off with a song called free will burning it's more of a speed metal power metal uh, song um, it's the, f the fastest song on the whole album. Um, it It's one that's divided me. I've been a fan uh, for a bit of it and other times I don't want to listen to it and it's um, a bit hit and miss with me. Um, and then I would give that Free Will Burning song um, Probably a seven and a half out of ten. <laughs> then you got Jawbreaker, which has got an amazing intro. I love it, um, and I use I've all, I've loved that song for many years. Um, just refresh myself with it just now on the stereo, and uh, it's it's still got that amazing. Still think the intro is awesome. Uh, it is better than free will, free will burning, um, and I would give that an eight out of ten for sure. Uh, rock hard, rock free is a great song. The intro to that is amazing as well, um, and I would that's that's a good uh, driving song. Um, I would give that. An eight and a half out of ten. Then you got the Sentinel, uh, which has got an awesome intro as well. Um, awesome song, um, and yeah, just I would give that uh, a nine and a half out of ten. Then we go on to Love Bites, which is uh, still a great song. Um, can get a bit a bit boring sometimes uh, for me um, I will listen to it uh, without skipping so um, if I put this CD on and I want to listen to certain songs uh, I don't normally choose that one so much um, Love Bites I would give a seven, seven and a half out of ten then Eat Me Alive I used to love Eat Me Alive, um, but I find the intro really a bit boring for that sort of, that song. Um, and uh, I have listened to it again and thought, yeah, it could do with more than just saying Eat Me Alive. It it's a good rocker for sure, um, but. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna give that a seven. <laughs> then you got um, some heads are gonna roll, which has got an awesome intro to it as well. Uh, and I do love that song. I've loved that song for a long time. Um, I would give that an eight and a half out of ten. Then you got night comes down, which is the song that gives me goosebumps and makes my hairs on my arms stand up when I listen to that song 
that song just every time I listen to it I just it feels like someone just walked out from my grave and go <laughs> um, yeah night comes down that's definitely I, I would give that a 12 out of 10 if I could that is my favourite song on this album all, all in all uh, but obviously I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10 because that's the max Heavy Duty, I don't really like. Uh, I would only give that a 4 to 5 out of 10. And Defenders of the Faith is just... It's shocking. <laughs> it's, it is crap. Uh, when you name your album Defenders of the Faith, you really are expecting an awesome song. And it's at the end. And it leaves you thinking, I, I listen to all them amazing songs then Heavy Duty was like a disappointment and Defenders of the Faith, <laughs> Faith Defenders of the Faith was just like oh my god that was at the bottom of the shitter for sure um, <laughs> um, so yeah I'd only give that a 1 out of 10 uh, sorry Judas Priest but I know it's only one minute and 26 or whatever seconds long, whatever. But Jesus Christ, that is shit. Um, when you listen to... Um, when I compare it to uh, a very, very short song that's uh, by, by White Snake, and it's called We Wish You Well. It's just a little minute long song or something like that and uh, that is so beautiful and I wish it was a longer song it's so really cool and uh, and I listened to the this Defenders of the Faith thinking oh we're going to have an awesome song here and it's just like what the fuck is this and then you just think nah I would have I would have definitely changed the name of the album Not, I wouldn't have called it that so Metal Mickey I do agree with you there uh, and he, and the Heavy Duty is a crap song anyway as well <laughs> but I'll at least give that a 5 it's got it is <laughs> it's not that shocking that it could it would be as low as 1 or 2 <laughs> so um, yeah great artwork I love the artwork on this some people say it's pretty tacky, but I do like Judas Priest's um, artwork on their albums, uh, even though they're quite sim simple. And so uh, we can't confuse metalheads too much, can we? Because uh, most of us have, uh, well, we're not always the brightest in the bunch. <laughs> uh, so yeah. And when you're a metalhead, a young teenager, and stuff like that, and this comes out, you just think, fuck, that is just awesome. It's amazing. And most of the time, you're, you've been you're drinking alcohol, you're probably starting to drink alcohol, and you don't want it to be too complicated. So these songs really do rock um, by Judas Priest, and I can... The appeal of them is amazing, and uh, Rob Halford is just like the Fred, Freddie Mercury of the metal world. He's just he can just hit any sort of range. It's just amazing. So um, yeah, um, Judas Priest, not to be taken so seriously, Metal Mickey. <laughs> nah, we we all think you're amazing. You're a great guy, so. Um, but yeah, my overall score for this would be a nine out, uh, an eight and a half out of ten for that album. So, yes, that's what I'm going with that. Actually, yeah, I'd say an eight point two five. Sorry, eight point two five for that album. So. Keep rocking. Cheers for watching. And, uh,
next video. Maybe another Judas Priest, maybe something completely different. So, and if you can get it, get this. It's got so much uh, extra stuff on it for the collectors. So, cheers.